Well hello there lovely people, welcome back to my channel. Today we have an ASOS haul. I haven't done an ASOS haul in a hot minute. I found loads of little bits on there that I was really drawn to when I was just like, oh, a lot of these colours and patterns are what I want to be wearing for spring summer. And I think I have come across quite a few gems and a few duds. So I thought I would just share them with you because I know that you guys love ASOS. The amount of requests I get to do ASOS hauls is ridiculous. ASOS and Zara Galleys, you love them. So I think that we should get into it. In case you're new here, I am a UK size 10 and I have a 32 E cup chest and I'm about five foot two small. I know that you girlies like to use these videos to compare, you know, sizing and, and get an idea of what the item's gonna look like on you. So I hope that info helps you guys to make a decision. I'm pretty much a dead on hourglass shape. I have a larger chest, I have wider hips and I have thick thighs, girlies. And hopefully you guys will love this stuff too because some of the pieces I'm like, chef's kiss. Okay, I think we're ready, let's get into it. I've just shuffled and moved things over because I, I bought some flowers yesterday and I really want them to be in the video because otherwise like, you know, like they're just cute. They're brightening up my day anyway. Girlies, I've been a bit skirt mad recently. Like honestly, skirt mad, mini skirt mad particularly, even middies. To be completely honest, I've just been buying a lot of skirts. Like I'm looking at my rail behind um, the camera and there's a lot of skirts. There's also a lot of greens and a lot of blues. The first one is a blue. This actually comes in, um, I think, regular, petite and tall. I'll link them all down below. I got the petite one because I am five foot two. So uh, this is the skirt. Stunning, gorgeous. It's all ruffle. It's all ruffle and I absolutely <laughs> love it. Look at the color, look at that. Look at that color. Stunning. I'm just obsessed. I think it's gorgeous. It's got little turquoisey bits, little black bits. I, even with this top, I just think, I love it. I love it so much. I got it in a size 10 petite, like I said, and it fits like a glove. I honestly can't wait to wear this. I'm imagining holiday, little strappy black top, maybe not a tee like this, but like a little strappy or a bandeau, like a black bandeau, strappy black heels, my little black Fendi bag. I, f I feel it in my bones. Like I feel it in my bones. I cannot wait to wear this. Honestly, slow. So glad I got this. The one one problem I have with it is because it's a ruffle skirt, you can catch the ruffles. So you have to be really, really careful when doing it up. So I probably wouldn't wear this to go like out, out for like drink drinks, you know, like drink drinks. I wouldn't go, I wouldn't wear the, this out for that just because I feel like after a few, you're gonna go. I just feel like if something happens and the zip came undone or, or like you're literally just getting out of it at the end of the night, I feel like you would catch a ruffle and then that would be it. Like it would rip. <laughs> I very almost did because a ruffle got caught and I was like, no, I literally just got this girl. I can't catch a ruffle and rip it. But luckily mine was okay. I just feel like if I wasn't sober, maybe that wouldn't happen. So I probably wouldn't wear it like out, out for drinks, but like I'm thinking a few cocktails on holiday. I feel with a tan, this is gonna look stunning. Highly recommend, it's absolutely gorgeous. Again, comes in different uh, body types, like fits. So I'll put them down below. On to the next skirt. So I picked up this one and as much as I wanted to love this one, it's just too long on me personally. You'll see it in the cutaway. It's just too long. It's giving grandma. I feel like maybe the waist, the waistband is just too long. If I show you it like that, look how long this section is of just before the pleating here. It's just very long. I don't know if that's because we've all gone a bit low with everything recently. And I don't even think it is because I still love a high waist. All the other skirts are high waist on me. This high waist, I feel like a granny, and I don't know what it is. I feel like a mixture of a schoolgirl, like, and a granny. <laughs> Neither of those things in a good way. You know, it's just not giving what it's meant to give, girlies. So that's the pattern. I absolutely love the pattern. It's got butterflies and flowers. It's purple, blue, turquoise, all the things that I should love. But it's just I'm not vibing with it. I really am not, and I think it's just the length. This length here, the torso length, I do have quite a short torso um, for my height even. I do have longer legs than my torso. My torso is very short. And so I feel like that just doesn't really help with this skirt. If you are taller than me, if you're taller than five foot two, you might, you know, you might enjoy it. But honestly, for me, I just found it to swamp me a little bit, not very flattering. If you're taller, maybe give it a go. I really hope they bring it out in petite because it's so 
cute, it's the colours that I'm really enjoying, but for me personally, it's a no. Next up is this skirt. It's slightly different colour palette, so we've got kind of retro flowers here. Pinks, oranges, yellows, that sort of vibe. Again, I could wear it with this black tee because it has little like specks of black in. You could wear it with a white tee, black tee, a pink top, an orange top, you could colour clash, wear it with, a, I don't know, blue, purple, whatever you want. I absolutely love patterns like these. This I actually enjoyed on far more than I thought I would. Still not like mind blown with it not mind blown like that blue skirt mind blown i was like completely convinced i had it on i was like this is mine now it's, it's mine it's never going back this i kind of i'm still umming and ahhing let <laughs> me you know what you think in the comments it does look really cute on i like the material it's quite bright and airy it's just a bit i just don't know about the pattern i'm not i'm not 100 percent sold on the pattern itself but I do think it's really cute. It has these little ties so you can tie it up. Maybe this is what's putting me off, the ties. If this was just a plain denim skirt, maybe I'd feel a bit different. It's not even denim. It's like a, a quite a thick cotton material. It's not linen, but it's like a thick cotton. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think after seeing it on me. Do you think I should keep it? Do you think I shouldn't? Let me know. I'm still still teetering on returning it, not returning it, I don't know. Let me know in the comments because I really don't know about this one. Um, I forgot, I, I didn't tell you the sizing, so I got this one in a size 10. It does fit really nicely. I just don't know about the style and the pattern. Let me know what you think. Okay, so this skirt is gonna be a Marmite skirt for so many people. It is this, you're gonna see it better here, I think. That's as best you're gonna see it. It's got ruffles down the front, it's got a little eyelet detail, and it's got like a raw raw hem. It's from the brand The Crypt. The Crypt? The Crypt? Is that correct? Someone correct me. Is it The Crypt? I think it's The Crypt. Um, and it comes with this absolutely massive tag. It's huge, but um, yeah, I, I think I got it in a size medium, and it is swimsuit material in a skirt. So I feel like people are either gonna love it or hate it. Very stretchy, very short. Um, I tried this on and I can wear it mid waist where this um, skirt sits, so there. And it, for me, as someone who's five foot two, it still covers my entire backside. If you are taller than me, this skirt is going to be very short, whether you wear it high waist or low waist, because on me, it is, very risque it is very very short i would definitely more wear this on holiday for going out that sort of thing maybe to like i don't know a pool party if you're on holiday maybe you're going to ibiza you can go for something super short something like that this is going to be for you i think it's a cute skirt to wear as well if you are just by the pool or something and you want a cover up because it is that swimsuit material it's actually quite light, lightweight it definitely feels like a swimsuit i'm wondering if it would be waterproof i'm pretty sure it would be i wonder what it's made of So it's nylon and spandex, so I'm pretty sure it's fine to get in a, a swimming pool with if you wanted to use it as a cover up or something. But yeah, I get, again, I, I am kind of leaning towards keeping this, but I'm not entirely sure, just because it is so short. But a part of me is like, I'm sure, and I can get away with it, isn't it great? So I, I don't really know, I'm kind of thinking maybe this is a good skirt for going out on holiday, like going out out. This with like some chunky platforms, or even just a pair of trainers and then this kind of style top for like a kind of casual night out look. I don't know, I'm just kind of, I want to keep it because it does look really, really good on and it also fits me and my height and I feel like I'm leaning, to, I'm leaning towards keeping it really, aren't I? Right, last skirt like that's on its own. The other I have is part of a cohort, so I'll show it to you separately. This skirt is on the same level as that first blue one. I, as soon as I put it on, I was keeping it. So make of that what you will. It's a midi with this ruching detail. This is the secret girlies, look at this. It's a slit with ruching. This is the secret, this is the trick here. This is the trick here. This skirt is perfect for me in terms of this ruching and my height. So this is a midi skirt and it does fit maybe sli slightly, slightly longer on me. I got it on a, in a medium, it's not, it's not petite or anything. 
Um, it fits slightly on the longer end of things. So for me, middies can sometimes be maxis just because of my height. Not a problem. I can either get them altered or wear it as a maxi. But because of this detail at the front, you can undo this and change the ruching to be longer or shorter. So for me, if you're shorter, you can make the ruching really short, like this on me is, is, isn't is even showing anything, <laughs> really. I'm that short. But if you're taller, what you can do is look, you can undo this and like undo some of the ruching. So you can make the leg slit lower. It's also good if you're, you've got different occasions. So say you're going to a, I know, a family barbecue and you don't want your whole leg out, you can do it the longest and then it's just a small slit at the bottom say then you're going out in the evening ruche that bad boy up and then you've got a short slit look at that and i absolutely adore it it's very lightweight the colors are gorgeous and i feel myself gravitating grabbing this skirt constantly throughout spring and summer i feel like it's definitely a skirt that i'm going to throw on um brunch picnic family gathering out shopping, running errands with trainers on, this and this t-shirt probably, like genuinely, <laughs> I will probably just put this on, and then my Nikes, that's it. So, out of wearability, this is, I haven't even shown you the rest of the, the haul, this is my favourite piece in the haul, just for wearability, I feel like I'm going to wear it so much. Totally forgot to tell you girlies, I got it in size medium, and I wear a UK 10, fits perfectly on me. Perfect. Next up is a co-ord, slightly, slightly disappointed with the co-ord. It is this yellow co-ord, it is from the same brand as the skirt only, and I was just a bit disappointed with it. I got both in a size medium, and I feel like they just don't go. They just don't go. <laughs> they don't go. You'll see what I mean on me, I think. The shirt is a bowling style shirt, which I completely just didn't see. I thought it was a long sleeve shirt. It's a, it's a cropped or like, you know, short bowling shirt with short sleeves. And then the, the, the shorts are, are long shorts. Um, it's giving, it's giving all American resort wear. Do you know what I mean? Like it's, it's, it's not, it's not doing anything for me. I probably would keep the shorts if I had something to go with them. But this kind of canary yellow, I just feel like you need a matching you need it to match, you know? So although this was probably the thing I was most excited about, this co-ord, uh, it's definitely going back. Just for me, I feel like the shorts are too long on me, the shirt's too small on me, and it just doesn't, it just doesn't go together as a co-ord the way that I wanted it to fit. So yeah, unfortunately, I'll be returning this one. But if you are interested in it, obviously I'll link it all down below. Again, I think it's just a preference on like my my idea of what things should fit like. I would have liked the shirt to have been bigger with sleeves, the shorts to be shorter, but you know, it's just preference really. Next I have another cover, this little pink number. I posted this over on Instagram. You guys loved it. So let me show you what it's all about. This, this top I've actually worn loads. I've worn it quite a lot with jeans, with other skirts. It is so versatile. I absolutely love it. It's just a stretchy, pink top with a little tie back there let me have a look what size did i get it in i got it in a size 10 and it is stunning the skirt too really nice secure waistband that holds you in stretchy we love to see it and i think i got this one in a 10 as well they're both from miss selfridge and i love the fact the skirt has a slip this set is so flattering and it is the most perfect bubblegum pink you know it just brings out color in your face, you know, it's one of those pinks. Stunning, I absolutely love it. I think that the color is perfect, the fit is perfect, and I, I'm getting so much wear out of this top, which I didn't think I would be. I'm kind of pairing it with everything, and it just looks so cute. Love it. Last but not least, I have some tops. So I bought this t-shirt in, what's this, size 10, and it has this, lovely little blue trim i kind of wish i got it a size smaller just because i do like my baby tee fits and i feel like this is a little bit long it's more like tucking in length or tucking up length to be honest with you i probably won't be bothered to order it again in like a size smaller so i probably will just tuck it up or tie it up tuck it into my bra you know just do the usual to make it cropped um i think it's really cute though look at the little blue little blue sleeves. 
I think it's really cute. I kind of just wish that it was just a little bit, you know, a little bit smaller. Next up is this top. This top is from Miss Selfridge and it is a little tie up corset top. I got this one in a size 10 as well. And I just love the little pattern on it. I like these little tie ups here. The only problem I have with this top is that the, it doesn't really matter how much you tie these <laughs> up. I'm finding that if it, even if it's me, I asked Alex to tie them up for me as well. They just kind of, you know, regularly. They fall off your shoulder regularly, but um, if you can tie them up real, real tight, they might just stay up. But I haven't tried that yet. But it is a really, really nice top. It fits really, really nice. I don't know. I don't know whether I want to keep it or not. I just don't know. I've got so many corset tops. As soon as this arrived, Alex was like, babes, do you, do you need more? And I was like, well, maybe. maybe." So it's kind of it's kind of made me think, do I, do I need another corset top? I still have a lot of Zara corset tops that I've, I've yet to wear out properly because obviously the, the, the weather has kind of been on, off, on, off. So when we get into more consistent weather, I think I'm going to start wearing tops like this more often. But imagine this with like baggy jeans and a blazer, like a cropped blazer. I think it's going to look real cute, right? Trying to convince myself, trying to convince Alex. I think I should keep it. I don't know. It's really, really cute. Let me know in the comments. I love these little bows. I just think they're a really nice little cottagecore detail. If you don't want to go full cottagecore, but you still want to like nod to it, this and a pair of baggy jeans. Very Y2K, but also cottagecore. Very cute. I also totally forgot to put a cutaway for this top, but I thought I'd just try it on for you guys. Now it is weird. It's weird. It's ribbed. Like it's ribbed. It's not just a pattern. I thought it was just like a stripe pattern. It's ribbed. So it feels a bit funny to me. I don't know if I'm going to keep it, but I thought I'd show it to you anyway. It has this lovely contrast neckline. I just don't like, like if I do this, can you hear it? Like it's ribbed. That's not just like the pattern. Um, so it feels a bit weird on, but yeah, this is a size eight. So I did size down in this one. I feel like this fits better, slightly smaller. So I might order that white one again. I might just, I might just have to because I feel like I do prefer like the smaller baby fit tea style. Okay girlies, that is everything in today's video. Obviously my favorites were the two skirts, the floral one that had the little ruching and the blue first one. Two, those are my tea favorites officially. I have a thing for skirts at the moment. Let me know if you wanna see like inside my wardrobe, maybe I could do like all of my skirts because I have so many, not just the ones I've just shown you, so. Maybe I could do a little reel or a TikTok about it as well. I don't know. I just feel like you guys would be like, what? If you saw how many mini skirts I currently have. But I am like willing. I'm, I'm, I'm manifesting sunshine and bare leg weather. Just constantly right now. <laughs> as always, let me know your favorite piece in the haul in the comment section and down below. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content from me. And I will see you lovely lot in my next video. Bye. Thank mm -hmm. you.